Welcome to this new episode of Ocrim News Live, which is part of the series Exploring the Ocrim World. Right now, I am in what has been Ocrim's convention hall since 2011, which was named after Silvia Pagliarani, a place that has important and deep origins, a place that for us at Ocrim means many things and interprets many concepts that belong to us. Concepts that we wanted to display and represent in this place, to give our guests and visitors a tactile and tangible idea of the character of this company and its industrial journey. Many of you will be familiar with it, because oftentimes it has hosted the conferences of our annual event Grano Farina E as well as being a venue for conventions and other important meetings that require state-of-the-art technology. In fact, the conference room has its own control room that is renewed and updated according to the latest technological progress. But what really tells the story of this place is the message imprinted on the wall. Will to power. A concept that is part of Nietzsche's philosophy and that indicates a will and intention as a perpetual renewal of one's values. In the past, this room was also home to other working areas of Ocrim and right for this episode, we wanted to have our sales director, Stefano Mazzini, who is one of the historical pillars of this company and uh, will help us retrace the story and vicissitudes of this place. Good morning, Stefano. Good morning, Eloisa, and thank you very much for this opportunity. Uh, once again, buongiorno. Good morning, everyone. So, what can I say uh, considering this place, which is part of our history? Now, the company Ocrim was incorporated back in 1945. This place uh, was built in 1948. This is where the foundry was. Hundreds of uh, people uh, came here because, you know, this wing of Ocrim was uh, kept alive, so to say, for, if I'm not mistaken, around 40 years. Then, of course, uh, one day the foundry was uh, discontinued and dismissed. Now, when it was created, it was an exceptional event for our city, Cremona. It was an exceptional thing. I mean, it was cutting-edge technology at that time. Now, back in the 1990s, uh, the foundry stopped uh, its operations. So, inside this big building, uh, we created a completely restructured uh, Congress Center. We had here a 24-ton mill. Now, the mill is still up and running. This, it's been operated. This is something that we use basically for training and educational um, targets. What else can I say of, of, of this part of this building? I mean, I left my heart here in this place. and. Uh, I have to say, people working in Ocrim uh, have been here and we all experienced this place in such an important way. There's another thing I'd like to say um, having to do with this place. I don't remember exactly the year, I think 1976, if I'm not mistaken. The foundry uh, was used for shooting a movie with Renato Pozzetto and Dalila Di Lazzaro, two Italian uh, actors, one actor and one actress, so we still have some of the, uh, a part of the movie that we keep in our archives. It was a very special moment, especially for the staff of Ocrim, because the staff here interacted, I mean, with the uh, actors. I've seen some pictures and some frames. Now, yeah, it's La Tuada's film, Ho Serafina. La Tuada. Yeah. You're right, I forgot the title. It was a very special thing, we all remember, you know, this, it's uh, such an interesting thing. And many students, by the way, passed through here, because Ogrim's technology school moved here for a while because of the Molino Scuola. Again, you're right, the mill was basically a uh, support for us. We restructured it, we renovated it, and uh, for some time we had uh, um, pastry and uh, bread making school here, plus technology, which of course uh, has to do with Ocrim's main uh, target or main job. We also had uh, a technological lab, which is still here. Yes. 
Okay, all right, Stefano. I thank you. We all thank you for this valuable testimony, and maybe we will also involve you for other useful information. Why not? Let's see. So, okay, with pleasure. See you at the next episode of Ocrim News Live. See you all. Bye bye. Thank you.